Okay, I told you we were going to paint this uh, this little wizard that we just got through doing, and here he is. And I'm using a red uh, oxide, it's called, to uh, paint the uh, the brim or the hat with, and that's what I'm using to paint the hat with. And I've got my water, and I've got my uh, paints, and we're just going to paint this little jewel up, stick him in the antiquing solution, and we'll have us a little, uh, little figure here. Yes, it's, it's a real, real simple carving project, and, and even a more simple painting project. It doesn't require a lot of uh, uh, detailed... Uh, you know, off the wall painting, anything that's that is real difficult to do. Uh, it's it's pretty simple. Now I, I'm using a red oxide. Now you can use a, a cherry red or anything like that. You know, or something that looks looks like Christmas. go. So actually there's only really three different colors you're going to be using on this. You're going to use the red for the hat, then you're going to use the white for the beard, and then you're going to use the flesh tone. And all together we'll stick it in our antiquing solution. So there you go. Now a lot of people, like I said, they, they like theirs maybe a little bit darker. And you can always go over this several times to get you a little bit darker color. But you painted the uh, uh, the hat. Okay, I'm going to use the cream colored flat. Uh, excuse me, the cream colored white to do the beard with. Okay. Use my my. Uh, Use my white here. Now you can paint your beard. You can paint it any, any whatever you want to be, but usually, you know, we paint them white uh, to kind of signify the the Christmassy. Uh, Santa or the, uh, like I said, this is a little wizard. You can also make it a, a little Santa or, or whatever, in other words. Just use your imagination. Let's go to the back back here. Like I said, this is a neat little old project. I'm just uh, so pleased that Tom did it for Wood Carving Illustrated, and I wrote him and asked him if I could use it to help y'all learn. And, of course, as gracious as Tom always is, he said, of course, and uh, he said the only reason he did it was to for beginners and to help them learn. You know, most advanced carvers, they, they've already either done something like this or whatever. But... Uh, uh, like I said, Tom is, is, is a lot like me. He, he loves to just, uh, Tom has told me he loves to, to make projects where you can just sit and whittle. And he's made some uh, full-fledged little, uh, we'll do that sometime, little uh, wizards that uh, are just as cute as can be with the whole body. And uh, he's just kind of the, the wizard man of, um, I'm going to grab this here. The Wizard Man of, uh, of the Wood Carton Illustrated uh, thing. And besides being that, he's just a heck of a nice guy. As you will find in most carvers. They, and I'll, I'll tell you, that's why I want you so much to, to get a subscription to Wood Carton Illustrated and join. Because you 
carvers are the, and I've said it before, and I'll keep keep saying it again. Carvers are the nicest people in the world. They really are. They they are. When you ask them for a little help, they're always willing to to help you to because they love this hobby. They love carving, and they love uh, showing you how they do it and and such things. Okay. There we go. All right, that's our uh, that's our beard we got there. I got a little bit of didn't do a little place up here. When it dries, sometimes you can see that. There we go. That taken care of. Okay, now what we're going to do. We're going to get our flesh tone with our smaller brush. And we're going to paint our little face right in here. Get your little smaller brush in to do this because you got to kind of get in the crevices and stuff like that. See that, that the, the thing about this little project, not only is it is it is it you know you can carve it pretty quick, but you can paint it pretty quick too. I mean, you make this little afternoon project, and uh, uh, man, everything will be hunky dory. Let's get in there and. <clears throat> 